Action. We are going to shoot in the bush. My name is Vivian. Sorry. I live for Douala, me and my mommy and my pa. With their name now, Mrs. and Mr. Ngam. The director never really knew us, so he never knew what we could do. So it was like, just write your names and all the things like that. So it was one Sunday, the director came to visit us in a meeting. He was impressed. So he just picked me and just like a magic or a dream or a miracle, we can call it, the girl that was meant to act the role had another opportunity to travel out. So I was the only one that could replace her. My position is uh, the said manager. I ensure that everything is put in place for the success of the movie. Come, uh, Vivian, mm -hmm. you know you see. After I talk about the ban. The shutdown at the Batibo, it was actually amazing because it was my first time of being there. And not only for a movie, it also helped me for sightseeing. And even where we were being lodged, we, we had a good time. Uh, after which we decided we took some shots in the evening. Having a crew like this one, I, I bet you you would, not, you would always like to look for people who are more committed, serious, and always there when they are being needed. It's not been easy. I've never gone through that before. It was very stressful, but due to my love for acting and this, everything, this. I was what? very patient. I'm still patient. Thank you. Bye bye. Bye. This movie we are shooting right now, we are on day three. We are preparing for another scene, very soon we'll go on set. Like you can see, the technicians and the director, they are behind that, trying to arrange one or two things. I'm called Bitini Bitza. When I read the script a year ago, it was a wonderful script. And um, at that time, I did not know if I would even participate in that movie, you know, but as time went on, I discovered that I had to do something. The battery is not there. No, the battery is not there. I've worked with other directors. Yes, they have their flaws. But since I've been working with this director, Everything is calm, everything is cool, he's understanding, he listens to you, he tries to get you into your mood and yeah, so he's a good director, a great one. I've been working with him for a very long time and this is not our first movie. I like the way he always talked to us, you know, he made us to know all the challenges and the things that we have to go through. I personally was involved in the writing of this movie. The movie, just from the story itself, it's a real life story, something that happened. We had to stir it up a little bit with some salt, pepper and some maggi so that it should be more entertaining and more teaching because a tragic story like this should not be told only in a tragic manner. <laughs> you don't to me. Vivian again. Ben abandoning his own family and then going after a girl, forgetting his own parents just because of the girl and at the end the girl disappoints him like that. 
it is not quite a good thing. And so my expectation is that people should learn something from this and that the film should go to highlight the market. People should love to watch it. It's a story that is meant to educate young girls, to educate people that are after money. Not only the girls, no uh, boys. Uh, boys, but also our parents. Yeah. Wealth without work is a danger to mankind itself. So this story is an inspiring story. Yeah. It's going to be worldwide. Yeah. yeah. So we want the movie to be the best that has ever been acted in Cameroon, especially here in Bamenda. Mm -hmm.